What's going on, his squad? It's your main man, Hitman, and I am back once again with the daily spawn updates for Red Dead Redemption 2 Online. This is for the family heirlooms, all our jewelry, the coins, the arrowheads, the flowers, the antique alcohol bottles, all tarot cards, the bird eggs, and the fossils. Today is Saturday, Saturday, July 31st, and as I say, each and every video smash that thumbs up button if you find this video any bit informative or helpful in any type of way and if you're watching just browsing just checking out the channel just checking out the cycles just checking out me in general make sure you guys subscribe we are super close to that 300 mark so <laughs> subscribe that that's my personal goal then from there it'll probably be like a thousand maybe i hope we get there Anywho, <laughs> smash that thumbs up button and make sure you guys subscribe. Hit the notification bell so you guys can get each and every video that I put out because I put out videos each and every day. Um, first things first, let's get to or before that, if you guys want to know Madam Nazar's location any bit earlier than this video, uh, you can follow me at Hitman Miyagi YT. I did not say that last video, which I did. Uh, kind of realize after the video but hit me miyagi yt it's in your bottom left hand corner of your screen it's down below the video there is a hashtag and it's down in the description box below with the newly added um cash out for any donations if you guys do want to donate to the channel if you guys support me and want to continue to support me even if it's 50 cent i, I am not begging for don donations but if you guys do want to donate it's there. Um, first things first, let's get to Madame Nazar's location, which I did say I was gonna try to make this video between 10 and 12 minutes long. But Madame Nazar's location, she is up here in Grizzlies East, right near Oak Creek's Run, Moonstone Pond, and Three Sisters, just past Three Sisters. How I get to her is I simply run out of my moonshine shack or i do spawn near my moonshine shack so i just travel up to her location which is right here if you guys do not have that moonshine shack if you have it you can simply fast travel to your moonshine shack and run up from there but if not fast travel to emerald station and run up from there because that's close as well super close super easy to get to her. it's just basically a straight shot you just follow the path do not make any turns onto any other roads just follow the the large path to her location she is right here and she will be here until 2 a.m that's eastern standard time new york time zone east coast time zone for those of you who don't know or not of america uh the next thing i want to get to is the caribbean rum antique alcohol bottle for today the caribbean rum antique alcohol bottle for today is inside of this shack right here right under the word window rock go inside this shack and to your left on the table to your left as soon as you walk in i think it's to the left you will find the caribbean romantic alcohol bottle and on the shelf to your right as soon as you walk uh in above the coat hooks you will find a Ten of Swords tarot card inside this house as well. Let's go down here to where we normally do business, which is the Lemoyne area of the map. I'm gonna have to block out maybe one. Try to get the, I try to get this stuff in super close for you guys. Um, but the cycles for today, Saturday, Saturday. <laughs> Uh, July 31st are Family Heirloom Cycle 1, All Luxury Cycle 2, Coin Cycle 3, Arrowhead Cycle 2, Wildflower Cycle 3, Antique Alcohol Bottle Cycle 3, All Tarot Card Cycle 1, Bird Egg Cycle 2, and Fossils Cycle 3. Remember to check the description box below because everything will be down there. The cycles written out for you guys. A link to a video for the current cycle of fossils and how to spell the Twitter and Instagram for the channel as well. The cash out for any donations if you guys want to know. 
Um, let's get to these things that we will find across the Lemoyne area of the map. Let's start with this one up here, right at this little farm area, farmhouse. There's a antique alcohol bottle. This antique alcohol bottle is a old time gem bottle. When you go inside this house, it's underneath the sink cupboard. Right here at this location, go inside the house, underneath the sink, that's what that is. And make sure it's an old time gen. It is an old time gen antique alcohol bottle. Right near this elimination series above the word Blue Water Marsh. Right in between the W of Blue Water, there's a family heirloom. This family heirloom is a ivory comb. This ivory comb is inside the boat, right beside the sink when you go through the door. Also, there's a fossil right here at this location. If you guys wanna come over here with your metal detector, that's what you will get, a random fossil right there at that location. Make sure you guys pay attention to the faint lines of the map because that will help you out so, so much. Um, let's go down to our next marker, which is, let's go all the way over here first. Right here at this location, you guys will get a random arrowhead. You do not need your metal detector, but you do need a shovel. Right here at this location, you should see a dig spot for a random arrowhead. That's what you will get when you do come over here in this location. When you walk up to the dig spot, you should get a prompt to dig. Right here by the O and by you at this house, there's a lost jury. This lost jury is in the chimney. So when you do go into the house, walk up to the chimney and you should get a prompt to search. You will pull out a Durant Pearl bracelet. When that's there, there's also a large tree in the background. This is always there. It's, it doesn't just magically pop up. <laughs> but to go towards this large tree in this backyard with your metal detector and you will pull out a random lost jury. I cannot tell you what lost jury you will get. But when you do pull out your metal detector and you get the prompt to to dig, you will pull out something random, a random lost jury. There's also a tarot card right here on the back of this boat on a uh, barrel. That is a queen of wands when that's there. There's also one here like on a tombstone. And this is a seven of wands. And when that's there, there's also one inside this L-shaped shack, right about here. That is a nine of pentacles, by the way. Let's go over here to our next marker. Underneath the N and NWA, right here at this location, you guys will get a, another antique alcohol bottle. This antique alcohol bottle is a Irish whiskey bottle. It's inside the house on the table. That's all. That's all the information that you need. Um, let's go over to our next marker, which is a family heirloom. This family heirloom is a horse hairbrush. It's right here at this location on the back porch or deck on a table. So go and grab that. There's also a tarot card inside this little, I feel like I want to call it a botanical garden, but <laughs> it's a shop. Whatever this shop is, is a wasp shop or something like that. I feel like they, they sell like random things and stuff like that. Go inside this shop right behind the counter. You will find the tarot card, which is a king of swords. Um, let's go to our next marker, which is another tarot card right here at this location. You guys will get a eight of swords tarot card. This as well as this marker here, both of these areas, there's a white table. And on that white table, you will see a chessboard. On the chessboard, right here in this backyard, you will see a Eight of Swords tarot card. And right here at this location, white table chessboard item. This item is a family heirloom, which is a ivory hairpin. And that's in the eye of saying. Let's go down to our next marker, which is a fossil. This fossil is randomized. I cannot tell you what it is, but come right here at this location with your metal detector right there where that marker is, and you will get a random fossil 
right here over across the water. You may have to come up and around across the bridge and stuff like that. But right here at this location, you guys will get a bird egg. This bird egg is a spoonbill egg. It's in a tree, so shoot it down with a varmint rifle or a bow using a small game arrow. Let's go down to our next marker, which is the cardinal flower that spawns over here in this area each and every day that helps me personally indicate exactly what cycle the flowers are on for the day and cycle three for the day. Uh, let's go over to this marker here which is in the O of Meadows, if you guys can see that sideways, right here by Boger Glade. Inside that O of Meadows, there's another square. That square is a brick outline of a house. Go inside the middle of that brick, out, brick outline, uh, house outline, and you got, pull out your metal detector and you will dig up a random coin. I cannot tell you guys what coin you will get because it is randomized. Um, I want to go down here for a little bit right here at this house. There are two things, one on the windowsill, uh, in one of the bedrooms, there's a tarot card, which is a page of cups and inside the house in the cabinet in the bedroom, there's a Tennessee whiskey antique alcohol bottle. Let's go up to Rhodes for a little bit. Well, I have a couple things to tell you guys in Rhodes. There's two family heirlooms, which one is in one of these bedrooms inside the saloon right here you look to your left uh there's a bedroom here and there's a bedroom here let's go closer there's a bedroom here and there's a bedroom here the bedroom that you're looking for is this first bedroom here uh go through the door and immediately go through the door to your right and you should be inside the bedroom in that bedroom on a chair on the ground floor, you guys will get a New Guinea Rosewood hairbrush, which is a family heirloom. Uh, there's a tarot card here. On the second floor, go up the spiral staircase, and on that table, you guys will get a King of Cups tarot card. And right next to this barn, right here, there's a dig spot. Uh, there's a barrel, and then there's a dig spot. The dig spot is... A family heirloom and it is a ebony hairpin so when you do come over here make sure you have your shovel and that's what you will dig up a ebony hairpin let's go up a little bit to our next location which you will get another tarot card right here at this location on a bench you guys will get a two of wands tarot card and right across the way from the fence right here at this location, there's another tarot card, which is a 10 of cups. One last item before we are done with this little situation. Right about here, I think it's up a little bit, like maybe here. Right here at this location, make sure you guys pay attention to the lines in the map. Right next to the D and pond, you guys will get a creek plum flower. Remember, this is a bush, not a flower with one single stone. Um, that's pretty much it for what I have for you guys today. Or all the extras that I have for you guys today. The cycles, once again, are Family Heirloom Cycle 1, All Laws Jury Cycle 2, Coin Cycle 3, Arrowhead Cycle 2, Wildflower Cycle 3, Antique Alcohol Bottle Cycle 3. All tarot card cycle one, bird egg cycle two, and fossil cycle three. Remember to check the description box below because everything will be down there. The cycles are linked to a video for the current cycle of fossils and how to spell the Twitter and Instagram for the channel. Thank you guys for watching, looking, listening. It is your main man, Hitman, once again. Thank you guys for watching, looking, listening, liking, sh subscribing, sharing, and everything else you do. If you haven't, if you don't, remember to like, share, subscribe, hit the notification bell so you guys can get each and every video that I put out because I put out videos each and every day. It's your main man, Hitman, once again, and I'm out.